Very good morning. Thank you for keeping it here on NBS Television. This is The Breakfast Meeting and I'm your host, Jackie Mutesi. We talk to different businesses every single day to understand how they're making us all better. Now, for our Muslim brothers and sisters, pilgrimage is not only a pillar of the deen, it is also an opportunity to seek forgiveness, renew their faith, pray for their needs, and come a little bit closer to Allah. Pilgrimage, like Umrah, has significant impact on one's mental and spiritual well-being. Now, Welly Tours and Travels have been helping Muslims make this life-changing journey to Mecca with their different packages every single month throughout the year. And joining me this morning is Sheikh Didat Kakoza of Welly Tours and Travels to help us understand what they have in store for Muslims this month of September. A very good morning to you, Sheikh. Lovely to have you. A good morning, Sister Jackie and uh, good morning to all our viewers and listeners. We are happy to be here once again after some, I think, kind of like a month. And uh, we'll be glad to share with you what we have in stock in this uh, few minutes that we are going to share with and Sister Jackie. Thank you very much. It's mm -hmm. always lovely to have you in the studio. Sheikh did it. I understand the package for August sold out. What are the special and key highlights of the September package this month? Um, as our motto goes, that we always endeavor to bring in new and uh, innovations in the service, not in the, the spiritual activities, but in the service, the innovations that would make uh, our pilgrims comfortable while performing their form of ibadah. So the September package, just like the August package, we expect to travel with the notable figures. The way in August we are traveling with the Imam Sheikh uh, Ahmed Chayne, we are expecting also in September to travel with some notable figures that will help in uh, uplifting the spiritual standards of the pilgrims while they're that side. And when it comes to the service, we will maintain our five-star service when it comes to the accommodation. And also, uh, we only use either Qatar or Emirates. And um, uh, when it comes to the buses, the ground transport, we maintain the executive uh, transport as well. So with September package, we promise you uh, the best, uh, actually the best of the best, because that is what we do. And uh, that's what we live up to as a promise between us and our creator. Absolutely. Sheikh did it. And how does the Umar package for September help Muslims in contributing to fulfilling their quest for the deen, for the journey? As uh, beings, we are all bound to sinning. And uh, we are never perfect. We are not angels, nor prophets. It's only those two creatures that do not sin, according to our belief in Islam. And I think it's a general... Uh, 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 perception, even other faith, that the prophets and uh, the angels do not sin. But when it comes to us, the normal beings, we are bound to sin, sinning. And uh, Umrah is an opportunity for us to cleanse ourselves from these sins that we commit willingly or unwillingly. So every time you get an opportunity to go perform Umrah, you have to utilize it. I think you had uh, one of our clips with uh, the late Haj Hussein Chanjo. He was saying that he doesn't regret. In his youthful age, he used to perform Umrah when he had the energy. Because uh, actually, uh, during the youthful age is when you sin most because you are energetic and uh, the, the temptations are more. So whenever you get the opportunity to go perform Umrah, September, August, November, you have to take it. However, you have to be considerate about your financial status and uh, your uh, family well-being. It shouldn't come at the cost of these two. But whenever you get the opportunity, you have to take it. That's why, uh, as uh, Wedi Travel, we made it easy for all the Muslim community that they can access the Kaaba at their convenience. Because before we came into market, they used to access, uh, the Muslim community used to access Kaaba only three times a year, in December and uh, in the month of Ramadan and also in Hajj. But for us, we opened it up uh, uh, every month of the calendar to give the Muslim community that opportunity, those ones who cannot 
uh, get the holidays uh, from their work in December, at least they can go in September. That one who cannot manage September will go in November. That's why when uh, August was closed, we opened immediately September, because we know how much we need the spiritual upliftment and the cleansing of our spirits in front of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala from all our sins. And uh, we promise, inshallah, even after September, we'll organize for those ones who will have missed out on September, though we urge each and everyone who has got the intention not to miss out on September, because you, know, you never know if you'll be alive after September. You never know what comes after September. So when it comes to Ibadah, Ibadah is worship. We do not procrastinate. You mm -hmm. take the opportunity when it arises. Immediately when it arises, you take it. You do not procrastinate. You don't wait for tomorrow. So if the opportunity is uh, September, please take it and travel with us. You'll never regret because we'll be with you, we support you, and we guide you spiritually and uh, also uh, throughout the journey so that you perform your ibadah in the best of the ways that you can manage. Absolutely. Sheikh Didat, you've mentioned that the August package was basically sold out. What contributed to the success of the August package and how is the September package going to build upon that success? I think uh, basically, because uh, most of our packages usually sell out, more actually 90% of our packages, uh, it's because we try to live up to our promises with our clients. We do not disappoint. And that is not because we are supernatural, but with the guidance of Allah and also the commitment of the team, we usually deliver the way we promise or even beyond our promise. And uh, uh, also that uh, after Hajj, between Hajj and now, we never had any other package. And uh, so uh, August package came after Hajj. Many people could not travel for Hajj, so they all came into uh, join with us in August and we know even September will be the same case so we urge all our, cl our clients or whoever that has got the intention to travel to come a little bit early you come to the um, offices you'll be guided even if you don't have the full amount you talk to our uh, the staff they will help you to open up an account because for us we have that system someone can open up an account you deposit in installment until you complete the package amount and you travel with us. So August sold out, uh, one, because of the grace of God, because it's, it's beyond us. And uh, then it's the support from our clients uh, that uh, who support us and also the commitment of the team that delivers beyond what it promises. And we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to help us maintain uh, that stab uh, stability so that we never disappoint, we never promise what we do not deliver. Sheikh Didat, Thank you've you. mentioned the commitment of the team. As a team, how do you ensure that your client's journey is smooth, calm, and aligned with their spiritual journey? First and foremost, we take enough time, ample time, to study the entire journey before we commence into the journey. We sit down on a drawing board and design the journey before we commence with it. So our journey usually starts here in Uganda. Most of the people, their journey starts when they land in Medina. But our journey usually starts a few days before we travel. That's when we gather all our clients, we sit with them, we, we educate them about the entire journey, what to expect, how to conduct themselves when they travel, and then we watch them as they set foot from the airport because the team follows the entire crew. We go to the airport, those ones, the team which is traveling and the team which is not traveling. So we watch our clients from Entebbe Airport. We travel with them along the way until when we get to Medina. And usually in Medina, we have an advanced team which prepares for us before we reach there. So by the time we get to Medina, at least uh, everything is, is in position so that uh, our clients whom we expect to be very tired from the jet lag and what, to just get into their hotels and refresh without any uh, impedi impediments. So uh, 
that's one of the things that help uh, us deliver as a team, because this cannot be attributed to a, a single person or an individual, but the entire team is always cooperative, and uh, with the guidance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, we manage to deliver as we have mentioned. Preparation, I hear, is key for Wali travels. Mm -hmm. Other than Hajj and Umrah packages, what else do you offer to your Muslim brothers and sisters? We, as Wali Travel, it's a tour and travel company, and uh, it's beyond, its services are beyond Hajj and Umrah, because we process visas to all the Gulf countries, Qatar, uh, Dubai, uh, Saudi, because there are some people who travel for business in Saudi or for, uh, for visit and these visas can be uh, uh, 12 months or six months, whatever, according to your, 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 your need. So we process these visas and also we issue tickets to all the destinations around the world. And uh, uh, these are some of the, the services that we, we offer at uh, Wedi Travels. And also we organize tour trips to Dubai and even in Uganda for those ones who are flying in to Uganda. We can help them do hotel bookings and uh, ground transport, organize the ground transport for them. Same as those ones who are flying to Dubai mostly. We organize the ground transport and uh, hotel bookings and also the site, uh, site viewing for them in Dubai. So we can organize the entire uh, tour trip for a person to Dubai from Uganda until when he comes back to Uganda. I see. And for your hotel and flight services, what kind of clients do you attract for those packages? Actually, when it comes to uh, these other services, besides Hajj and Umrah, we are open to the entire, uh, to all the clients. I see. So those ones who want three star, we can avail them. Those ones who want two star in Dubai, we can get you. you those ones who want uh, a single star, we can get you. And also, the, when it comes to the tickets, we can... Uh, uh, issue tickets on all the airlines that uh, uh, land in Entebbe airport. So all the airlines which access Entebbe, we can issue the tickets. Uh, actually, that service is 24 seven, because uh, we have clients who travel at night and we have to make sure that at the time our clients are traveling, we are at least uh, accessible and we are reachable for them in case of any challenge. So when it comes to ticketing 24-7, uh, we can attend to the clients and for all the airlines uh, of their choices, inshallah. Now, Sheikh did that we are in this era of the digital age. And I want to know, do, is it possible for your clients to book without ever coming to your physical address? It's very possible. Actually, even when it comes to Hajj and Umrah, there are some clients whom we get to meet physically in the transit more especially for, for Umrah. We get to meet physically in the transit. Maybe if we use Emirates, we meet in Dubai. If we use Qatar, we meet in Doha. So they process all the entire, uh, I mean the entire trip with us online. Uh, mostly those ones who are not in Uganda. Uh, like those ones who come from the UK and the US. We process for them uh, when they are not here. If they don't need to come to our, our offices. And uh, even if someone is in Uganda and uh, he's uh, unable to, ask to come to our offices because we respect you know, the, the business, the busy schedule for each and of our clients, so they can just uh, reach us on call. Actually, we can go to them. Sometimes we go to our clients. We, we go to their offices if they cannot come to our office. So uh, the offices are just the address for that one who can conveniently come and visit us. But we still reach out to all the clients, uh, no matter the busy schedules, if they are in uh, accessible places, we go to them. Absolutely, Sheikh Didat, mm -hmm. can you share your physical address and perhaps a contact number for somebody who'd like to reach you? Yeah, we are on Lodel Tower, Lodel Road, Plot One. Uh, it's uh, opposite the Ministry of Public Service and also the uh, Platinum Hospital. It's there in Nakasero, and we are on the first floor. You ask for Wedi Travels offices, you'll be able to reach us. I see. And you were mentioning you're, uh, you're able to provide flights and tickets to, to different destinations. Yes. What yes. are the different destinations you can offer to your clients? Yeah, we can uh, mostly the Ugandans fly to Dubai, 
and also to China. They fly to even to Europe, uh, America, uh, all uh, countries in Africa. We can afford to get you the destinations, uh, more especially for these bigger countries like the US, they have many airports. No matter the airport, we can get you there. Go to, you're flying to New York or to Boston, and those ones who are flying to these destinations like South Africa and what, and actually we have some airlines that we can uh, help you book easily with them. So all in all, any client who wants to fly should come to Welly Travel and should expect the best of the best when it comes to the services. The best of and the best. And also the prices. And the prices mm. as well. Yeah. What are your closing remarks this morning? Please remind our audience in terms of the dates that they can actually book for the September package. Yeah, we, uh, as we close our program, allow me to thank all the viewers, our clients who support us uh, tirelessly and uh, continuously. Uh, we also pledge to continue delivering uh, the way we promise and also we continue to uh, to promise you that we'll always be innovative when it comes to service delivery and all the things that need to be added in the services and um, uh, allow me to thank you sister jackie and uh, the entire team who always host us here and uh, give us the opportunity to reach out to the viewers and uh, our clients and uh, uh, as Welly Travel, our doors are always open from Monday to Saturday. Uh, Satur Monday to Friday, we close at 5. Saturday, we close at, uh, at uh, midday. Uh, but you can reach us on the call. And also, uh, you can use the social media platform because we have Twitter and we have uh, so Facebook, Yahoo, and the website. So you can reach us through those uh, platforms. We are always eager to attend to you. Thank you so much. Sister. Thank you, Sheikh Didat. And what are the dates for the September package? The September will be tra uh, traveling 11th and uh, we'll be coming back on the 21st so of the September. So from the 11th to the 21st. Yeah. Mm. Mid-month. Mid-month. Well, thank mm. you very much. It's always a pleasure to have you in studio. Thank you so much. I've said this to you before and I'll say it again. Being in Sheikh Didat's presence is so calming. It is so relaxing. Here's this Zen energy. And if you're watching us, this is something that you can achieve for yourself by booking with Welly Travels for their Umar package for the month of September 11th to 21st, mid-month. And like they said, you always have an option to do something next month to also book if you're traveling to China, to any other country, for your visas, hotel, and flights. Whilst you're looking after your spiritual self, it's also important to look after the environment that you operate in. Don't forget to recycle, reuse your plastics. You have a lovely day. Keep it here on NBS Television.